Well, 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 what we got here? After waiting so long. Okay, this is initial review for this Dasang color e-ink monitor. This is curved version and built-in front light. So when it is powered off, this is how the screen look like. And if you power it on, then that's how it look like. So power is on, but the PC is not sending the data yet, so let me turn on the PC. See, this is really the early, uh, I would not say a review, I'm just saying like 
I'm kind of trying to show this monitor. I will review it later because I just received it yesterday. I used it last night. And I'm going to give you just to see. Okay, so that's the problem. First, uh, like it came like this. When I turned it on and my heart sinked in like even if I remove the ghosting this is how it look like but then I later I have to adjust you have to be very careful so the view look like a, a painting kind of view it's not proper like monitor view it is a little bit disappointing but let's do that let me change the theme it's really difficult to find where the theme is it's not and so try to make it theme little brighter so you have to do it everything white then you might be able to see something and then you see the mouse it has uh, this when I move it I get something here when it has resolution of 4k so I have to reduce the resolution as well or at least I think you can keep the resolution but I can change it to 150% scaling still doing that This is not doing before, so let me maybe do it. Change the resolution to this. Okay. Yeah, it's better. Sorry, guys. I'm actually. This is my like day one, you can say day two. I didn't use it yet. No more flickering after changing the mode. So it looks better now, but it's still not like a monitor or monitor. It still looks like a picture, pixelated. And the main problem I have is uh, the screen. When I was buying it, uh, it was like. It's called Clido screen, I think. It says Clido screen sports 4096 colors. With more than 4000 colors. So that's, I really doubt here. I don't know. Really support that 4096 color or not. Or maybe they reduce the number of colors to improve the speed. Anyway, so. Let's test the screen. So you start the test. It is pixels. Does it look like a dead pixel? Really? Just found two dead pixels, I think. Two, three.
I will double check that, but they're like one, two, three, and four red pixels. The screen is so pixelated that I might ignore those, ignore those dead pixels. So you see, this is the gradient. Uh, that's what I want to show. That's why I really doubt that they have all the four thousand colors here. If I change it to the cyan, magenta, no, red, green, blue. You see, only blue is here, a little bit lighter. Then it start getting all the way dark here. It's not, I, I can barely see up to here if I like really focus then. And go to next. This is writing, writing not too bad. So this is a speed, it, not too bad. That's really encouraging. And that's it. Let me okay. Let's watch this one. I'm gonna mute this so you can see this is a video let me make sure that we are in video mode this is text mode this one is video mode it is really dark I will later upload comparison of this monitor with uh, monochrome the same also compare it with uh, RLCD monitor and the regular monitor I will also try to upload gaming on this monitor or video chat on this monitor So I was actually playing this really dark game, Limbo. So that is another reason. It looks really dark. Okay, this one is. Let me clear the ghosting. It is still really dark. Yeah, if you cannot see, that's the car. The car racing game, I don't know which one. <laughs> I cannot even read that. This is really bad, but let's go to, let's say I open some. The news, so reading is not too bad. It has, it still is better than what we saw on the same monochrome monitor. Notepad. I'm gonna add. This is sad. So writing is not too bad. Even this is video mode. Let me change it to text mode this one is text mode Quick round 
Jumps over the lazy dog. So you can see the writing is good. Okay, one more thing. Uh, the typing is not too bad. It's really fast, responsive. Mouse is laggy. But I'm not feeling really bad because I was expecting that. Even though this is, I think, uh, resolution is full HD, I think. Display setting. Resolution goes, to, let me take it to all the way. Keep changes, I think this is 3K. And then scale it to 150, yeah. So mouse become more laggy here. But I can definitely work with that. I don't have any problem with that. The problem currently I'm seeing is um, it's not clear. Things are not clear. Okay, this is my writing now. This became more difficult now. So let me clear the ghosting. Maybe scale it more. Let's do two hundred percent. It looks better. I mean, we can work on it, but I think what I need to do is make all the theme screens, wallpaper, everything white. Then I will be able to see it. That's what I did in my uh, the Sang monochrome monitor. Let me open. So this is Google Sheet. You can clearly work on it. This is really nice. Looks cool. Yeah, I forgot to mention. This one is working on this is front light. So let me change the front light. This is daylight. This is night light. And this is off light. So I think in camera it looks more clear than the naked eye. In naked eye it looks really dark. But it is still workable. So I think if I change the the theme and everything to white, I I will be able to work on it. So like Initially, when I started it, opened it, started running it, my heart really sank in. Like, I spent that much money and I cannot see anything. Then I change the resolution, I change the theme, and then it's workable. But it's still not good as the regular monitor. So, this is my initial review. Then I'm gonna upload, keep uploading review after using it maybe after changing theme and after comparing it to other monitors um, i'll keep uploading videos for that so thank you